that you did it because now if you believe it, say yes. Good morning, my Christian friends. And welcome to Sharp Street Memorial United Methodist Church Midday Devotional Time. We meet on Tuesdays and Thursdays at noon for personal prayer and uh, meditation. Our devotional comes from the, the upper room daily devotionals. And our devotional for today, Tuesday, December the, uh, oh my goodness, Tuesday, December the 6th, I'm very sorry. Uh, our devotional is entitled, entitled Resurrection Hope, Resurrection Hope. And our scripture, scriptural text for today is Isaiah chapter 61, verses 1 through 4, with the verse of emphasis being chapter 61, verses 1 and 3. The scripture, the Lord has sent me to give oil of joy in place of mourning and a mantle of praise in place of discouragement. Oil of joy in place of mourning and a mantle of praise in place of discouragement. And now for our message, Resurrection Hope. On a particularly beautiful Easter Sunday afternoon, I was lying on a grassy hilltop not far from where I lived. The sun was warm and fluffy. White clouds floated in a bright blue sky. It had been an extraordinarily hard 18 months, and I was feeling battered in body, mind, and spirit. In particular, it had been months since I had been able to walk more than a few yards without becoming exhausted. I was weary and discouraged. I longed for resurrection, resurrection for the same power that raised Jesus from the dead to fill me so that I could walk and run and explore God's creation more fully. But that felt like a far off dream. Then in the warm April sunshine, I sensed God telling me that this dream would become reality. At first, I dismissed it as a wishful thinking. However, as joy in the day's beauty welled up inside me, so did hope. I couldn't resist getting up on my feet to see how far I could go. Thus began a healing process that continues to this day Mourning turned to joy and discouragement turned to praise. Weakness slowly turned into strength. My hope and faith were renewed as I began to experience God's resurrecting power in a very new way. Today's prayer, resurrecting God you are the source of all life and goodness. Thank you for bring a, bringing us new joy and new hope through your resurrecting love. Amen and amen. Our thought for the day, what hope does the resurrection offer me today? And our prayer focus was for those who have lost hope. Well, we'll have a brief musical interlude, and when we return, we'll have an opportunity for you to offer your prayers to the throne of grace. Join us, won't you? Oh,